guys. I talked about updating my pedal board again. I wanted to try this vintage uh, XMR envelope filter in place of the um, uh, Qtron. And uh, there's a couple reasons why I'd never used this before. One was that it was really beat up, and at the time, all the other pedals were new. And I didn't like the idea of having a ratty-looking pedal next to a bunch of new pedals. Well, that's changed for a couple reasons. One is that the new pedals no longer look new, just from the... Even though they've been in the, in the pedal board, you know, there's a few little dings and stuff like that that just come from being used. Uh, this is a used pedal, and it's not in perfect shape. This was a used pedal, and it's not in perfect shape, so I figured... Um, you know, it was as good a time as any. Um, I did touch up the paint on it. I don't know if you can see. I didn't affect where the lettering was on there, but around the edges and stuff. So you can still see some of the old. You know, it's obviously not in perfect shape. Got some replacement knobs for it. Those were as close to the originals as I could find. Um, they're not exactly like the originals, but they'll do good enough. Um, and then I had to make it an, uh, get an adapter for it to make it uh, operate on the pedal. The one spot. I um, actually got a new one spot while I was at it because my old one was getting pretty uh, frayed. Um, and so uh, it was about time that I had... At least I'm going to keep using the old one, I think, until it actually dies on me, but I'll have a backup in the bag. Because um, you wouldn't believe if you saw how ratty my one spot is, and it still works. You know, the plastic casing for the transformer is cracked. The uh, wire itself is uh, twisted up to the point of... Uh, you know, it's 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 pretty ratty, but I'm going to keep using it, and I'll just have the new one as a backup and when it's time for the new one. Um, so, yeah, I'll do a video at some point demonstrating uh, this in the pedal board, but I've already done a video demonstrating this by itself. Um, so that shouldn't be anything urgent. And uh, everything else. Uh, obviously don't know how these are going to be set yet, but based on playing it, they'll probably be somewhat close to that. I hate... It looks weird to me just doing straight up and down, so I'm, you know, um, but that won't be that far off. By the way, this is what the actual knobs uh, should look like. They should look like these. Um, those don't use a set screw. So yeah, that's the new, uh, new pedal board. Um, if I change anything again, um, since I find myself using the metal zone more than the distortion side of the full tone... Uh, maybe I will get rid of the full tone in place of the bad monkey. Um, I don't know. I actually do kind of like the the boost. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. We'll play around with it. Um, yeah, there you go. There's the MXR. And I did uh, test it with the one spot, and it sounds just the same as it does with a 9-volt battery. Um, didn't try it in sequence. Maybe I'll do that later tonight. Um, so there you have it if you have any questions.